Welcome to this week's edition of the Fordham Ram Roundup with the women's soccer team and head coach Jess Clinton. Jess, last game, you guys got a great performance out of your team. A couple of big moments, whether it was the big goal by Mora, uh, the big play by Brooklyn, clearing the ball off the line at a couple spots from Kelly. What did you see in the game as the game developed and, and holding on for that uh, first win? I think we're seeing a little bit more of confidence. I think we're starting to see a little bit more life in our play and things are starting to come together a little bit. A little bit more uh, players are rotating into different positions and we're starting to get comfortable with kind of the relationships and the pairings. So there's a lot going on for us, uh, but Lehigh was just a nice moment for the team to pull it all together. Mora ends up getting that game winning goal on just a, a brilliant shot into the upper 90 there. Can you talk a little bit about how she sh she's developed from her freshman year into her sophomore year, getting a little bit more playing time and, and seeing a lot of action in that midfield? Mora has seen a lot of action. Uh, she did the work over the summer. She played at a high level, um, and her summer team made it into, I think it was the WPSL finals. Uh, so she has gotten a lot of momentum from there, and she's carried it over to here, which is why we encourage our players to play over the summer. Just experience why she's adding so much more than what maybe she offered her first year, and kind of that experience and that confidence is really starting to show. Uh, so it's a, nice, it's a nice step for Mora to take, and we can't wait for the rest of the season and more goals. This week you start a five-game homestand to kind of finish up non-conference play and heading into conference play. Yale and Manhattan coming up this week. What are you looking forward to to start that home stretch? And again, it's always tough to start on the road. Four of those first five were on the road. What are you feeling about getting home and, and kind of being here for a little bit? Well, we're hoping to pull out some two big wins or three big wins going into conference play. But uh, we really want to sew up some loose ends and get a couple more relationships a little bit more comfortable in where they're playing. Uh, but that would be the goal versus Yale. And then when we go against Manhattan, is sew up a couple more loose ends and just get ready for conference play. All right, well, thanks so much. Good luck this week against Yale and Manhattan. Thanks so much. We continue our Fordham Ram Roundup with our player interview with sophomore Mora Hulse. Mora, you get the game-winning goal in the last game against Lehigh, your first career goal. How did that feel? Oh, it felt really good. Uh, you know, it was something new for me, um, having my first points, you know, for my career. So definitely felt good. That play was really a turning point because it was late in the half, and it was an absolute uh, really nice play into you from Emma. Can you talk a little bit about how that play developed a little bit? Uh, well, I believe it was on a transition. Emma won the ball back and um, really did well putting it forward and you know, just kind of took a chance and worked out. So, um, you know, everything worked out. This season, getting a, little, a lot more playing time. Last year you played, you know, eight, ten games as a freshman. Now as a sophomore, what have you been working on to kind of get, to no get noticed and, and get more playing time and feel more comfortable in that midfield spot? Um, you know, we've been working a lot about, we've been switching formations up, really watching film and going over game by game what we can all do better, um, working as a midfield as a whole. So, um, you know, just learning from Maggie's super experienced in there, really trying to take after what Maggie's been working on and, you know, taking it game by game. This week you start a five-game homestand with the team to finish up non-conference play and then lead into conference play. What is the team feeling heading into after that win, going into a five-game homestand where you know you kind of get to settle in a little bit and, and feel a little bit of home cooking? Mm -hmm. Yeah, we feel really confident right now coming off this win. I'm really excited about the athlete barbecue. Um, we have really good vibes tomorrow for the home game against Yale, and we're really optimistic about what's coming. So. All right, well, thanks so much, Maura, and good luck against Yale and against Manhattan on Sunday. Thanks so much. That'll do it for this week's edition of the Fordham Ram Roundup. Special thanks to head coach Jess Clinton and Maura Hulse for joining us. Fordham Women's Soccer kicks off a five-match homestand on Thursday against Yale and then Sunday against Manhattan. Both those games can be seen on ESPN+. You can also follow the game's live stats, as always, and on Twitter at Fordham W Soccer. Just make sure to check out FordhamSports.com for all the links to find uh, to the game. For the Fordham Ram Roundup, I'm Scott Kwiatkowski, and we'll see you next time.